This is the Montreux Black. Today we're gonna react to Poe Skadoosh's Death Battle. Let's watch. Legend tells of a dragon warrior so skilled and deadly in martial arts that his foes would go blind from overexposure to pure awesomeness. A fighter of unrivaled power, wisdom, and rotundity. This is Xiao Po Ping, a panda born in the Valley of Peace. For the longest time, this valley only knew, well, peace. But everything changed when Gary opened the peacock and his army attacked. Lord Shen received a prophecy saying his conquest would be stopped by a warrior of black and white, a panda. So, in a bit of paranoia, Shen decided to genocide every panda in existence, forcing Poe's mom to part with her baby as he moses away in a reddish box. Jeez, we got real dark with the sequel, huh? After some obligatory trauma, Poe was taken in by a literal father goose named Pink. With his expert guidance, Poe trained day and night to be a waiter at a noodle restaurant. Not the hardline warrior life I was expecting. It was Poe's dream to be a martial artist. He idolized all things Kung Fu, going so far as to make action figures of his heroes, the Furious Five. <laughs> Nerd. However, he never expected to have the chance to actually explore that dream. Until the day of the dragon ceremony, where Master Uwe would select a chosen one to lead a new era of Kung Fu as the Dragon Warrior. And to the shock of everyone, Master Uwe chose him! Talk about a freak accident! There are no accidents, Boomstick. Despite some setbacks, Poe was actually quite gifted. He just needed the right motivation. A carrot on a stick. Or more accurately, a dumpling. Next to the Furious Five, Poe experienced the classic Shaolin animal styles which are actual practice martial arts. Tiger style uses ferocious combos. Monkey style has unpredictable acrobatics. Mantis style uses fast strikes. Viper style implements fluid movements. And crane style is all about sweeping hits. But none of them suited Poe, so he made his own. You guessed it, panda style. Which is sort of inspired by the real world dragon style, but mostly based around using his roundness for defense, wearing down enemies until he gets an opening. His body can stop just about anything. Balls, pressure point attacks, and even a clock to the face. But he isn't overwhelming you with his pure fatness. Poe can launch a Hadouken with a thundering wind hammer, immobilize foes with a paralyzing shoulder touch, and blind you with the Golden Lotus Clap! Wait, do you think if I try hard enough I can pull that off? No, probably not. You need Master Chi and... Oh, wait, your hands are glowing. No, no, that's a different thing. Sh that's back? I gotta call the doctor. Oh, then I guess come back next week for the full fight of Iron Fist versus Puff. Wiz, you're gonna want to come with me. It's highly contagious. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. I'll see you on my next reaction. This is the Montre Black. Peace.